So here I am back at the Blackfoot RC Scale Park in Calgary, Alberta with my Chevy showing a little bit of bow tie love here. Got some cut tires as always. Look at this, just enjoying the slow crawl. Got a, uh, a whole leaf spring suspension in the front. In the back, totally sprung set up. Look at the, the view in the background of Calgary downtown area. Just what a backdrop. It's this shot that I come here for, guys, just so you can kind of see. Not, not the ad advertisement in the background. <laughs> look at that. So choice. And if we back up and just have a look at the whole place, you can actually see it. there's quite a bit to have fun with here. this getting it down nice and low for you guys gotta give it some speed over this hole oh nice oh nice oh but I got hung up on the axle now I'm in trouble can I get out of here I can I can oh my god look at this not easy it's all how you position your tires how many people watching here today do full-size wheeling as well? If you go out on the trail right now, let me know in the comments section. Let me know what you wheel, as well as has uh, uh, wheeling with RC helped you out in the full-size wheeling as well, or vice versa. A lot of people think that folks that have small trucks like this do not wheel in full-size also, but that is just simply not the case. Something's looking a little twisted up in my back axle. It is not looking right. Something is busted in the suspension. Look at this. So, a whole bunch is busted. It looks like I busted off my back um, hanger for my top suspension. Looks like, yeah, that's exactly what happened. And then it twisted my whole back axle. Look at this big rollover. Big smash and dash right here. That's okay, it's not a big deal. It's just a simple hanger. And then my shock came off of the rod end. Let me see if I can snap that back into place. And then once we get that back in, it'll be a simple five, well, what, realistically $20 fix. But that ends my day of crawling, that's too bad. But this is one of my most favorite vehicles as well. You know, all the vehicles I have left in my collection are pretty much the ones that I've always favored or always enjoyed. I know so many people enjoy this one as well. I took out my homemade wheel wells out of this one when I changed out the motor, but that is gonna end it. Guys, if you love this orange truck, I want you to show me right now. Smash that like button if you are a Chevy fan. We will see you in the next episode of RC Adventures, my friends. I got shit I gotta fix now. That's all part of the hobby, right? Run them, break them, fix them, repeat. <laughs> Bye guys.